Yo, what's up? It's cute ill. Um, this is a pack I'm sending out to teaser shoutouts. Um, yeah, I'm debuting debuting a new sticker. Uh, I worked really hard on it. Um, it's my MC cute ill Celador brand swagger sauce. And I got my uh, let's see if I can get into focus. My West Coast LA <laughs> representing. Um, yeah, cause. For show, sure. I keep it spicy, you know what I mean? Alright, and uh, I got my other sticker. I haven't debuted yet, or I might have, but I haven't sent out to anyone yet. Uh, quickie, a little Slap Cancer promo sticker, a couple hand styles, Hello My Name Is, my Strict 9 cans. Um, and you said you wanted some blanks, and I said I would need to charge you at least for postage, because honestly, I'm going broke right now. But, um, you know what? You're a beginner. I'm sending you out these slaps because you're not in the U.S. And I know that getting blanks other than the U.S. is kind of tough. So I'm sending you a bunch of blanks. And, uh, one big tag. I don't know what you want to do with that, but... Yeah, why am I doing this? Because I see you're a beginner. I see you're serious about the game. I see you're young, and you know what, you you still have that giving spirit, you know, that's very important. I think, like, people in the graph game are too stingy, and, you know, it's so secretive or whatever, and yeah, I do believe that certain things people should learn on their own. I didn't really have anyone to teach me anything about graph. Everyone who knows me, who knows, like, when I get into something, I do my research. I sit there... I try to find out like a little bit of the history, do's and don'ts, learn like the the levels of respect you got to have because without respect, you know, it's just, you know, stupidity. Everything, hip hop, uh, graffiti, b-boying, DJing, everything, you got to just have a certain respect for like the people who came before you and the people who put it down and people who do work with what you want to get into. And if you're just like, you know, oh, this is toy, I'm going to go over it, but you don't know that's like a tribute piece, or you don't know, like, that's the artist who's been putting it down way before you were even swimming in your daddy's balls, then, you know, you don't know what's up with the game, and you shouldn't even attempt to get into it yet. That's why, if you're a beginner, if you're straight up toy, like, I mean, you don't even deserve a good black book yet, dude, take your time, don't go out there and rack, like, hundreds of dollars of markers and just go out there and like bu bug your mommy and daddy for a, for a Molotov like set don't do that it's not going to help you it's actually going to make you get cocky that you have the coolest you know new Montana can or whatever it's actually going to make you worse in the end because what happens when someone real wants to go painting with you and all they got is watery Krylon or color place and you can't do shit without your new skinny caps you know that's not going to help you out. Like, what you want to do is start out with the basics, you know. Start with what you got. I started practicing outlines with Crayola washable markers and crayons and color pencils. Who gives a shit, you know. You're not going to put this up in the Smithsonian or, you know, the Louvre or anything. So just do what you do on, you know, whatever you got around you. And then once you start elevating and you think, like, yo, this is the best I could do with the materials I got... Then you save up or, you know, do what you do, hustle, and you get the material that can actually help you expand more. You know what I'm saying? Like, look at all the art materials I got that, like, I've actually used before. I don't just, you know, keep it there to keep it pretty, you know? I, I experiment. Like, look at all these different markers and stuff. Some of them I hate, you know? Like, my favorite tool for writing on certain surfaces that I won't mention uh, is a pilot, you know, but I've tried the Sakuras, I use Sakuras, the Dallos are sick, you know, but there's certain things that, you know, you'll grow accustomed to that will actually limit you, you know, so you want to keep it legit, keep your skills sharp no matter what you got, you should be able to bust a burner and ballpoint pen and a sharpie if you have to, that's what I mean by being versatile, so that's just my little advice to you, so teaser, I'm sending you these blanks because I want you to get better. I want you to keep up the good attitude and help. This is my way of you promising me that you're going to help someone when you get better. 
and some beginner asks you for advice, don't just blow them off because, you know, I'm too tired of that. Like when I ask for help or something, no one's there and I want to be a good role model and like help someone out. So you guys, thank you for helping me out with Slap Cancer. I couldn't do it without you guys. I'm sorry if I ever came off big headed. I don't mean to. I'm just really hoping that this project goes well and like much love to everyone. Um, teaser, you know, do work with these. Practice your skills. You're you're getting a lot better. Um, I try to watch everyone's videos. You know, you guys sending me links and stuff like that. I try to watch your guys' videos every time I have free time. Um, yeah, I mean, I try to comment back and reply back to you also. But full time student at a university, and you know, I got a job now. Whatever. I keep mentioning that. You know, but everyone got to do what they got to do. So. Yep, I'm doing I'm doing my part and I'm trying to stay up and all that stuff, but yo, you know, there's only a certain number of hours in every day. So I do what I can. Um so I'll be sending these out to you guys. Um thanks to everyone who's been sending me stickers again. And uh yeah, I hope everything goes well and look out for possibly some t shirts and uh some cute ill merc that's merchandise, not mercenary. Uh, yeah, other than that, as usual, peace out, stay up.